Hi, welcome back. For this episode, we're going to be uh, putting together an eight-piece angled Roman candle rack. That's just an expansion upon the six-piece that uh, we built earlier. Try to keep it in uh, multiples of four and six for fire, uh, firework purchase potential and possibilities. As you know, Roman candles are cheap, they're inexpensive, you can buy bulk of them. So you can add a great individual piece into your show. So <clears throat> with that, as you can kind of tell, as I got everything kind of laid out. And I'll just kind of flip over here real quick. Okay, so we've got, I just wanted to make sure. Again, I use one inch spade bit off of a drill press to make my holes. Uh, of course, lay across the the top of the board okay. and then once, the, um, once my template's been made I go down to the base and I only will drill down maybe about halfway it gives a little bit of a sturdy base for it so for this as you can tell we're going to go ahead and build our base again I'm using one and one quarter inch Brad nails with my nail gun. So I apologize uh, when you hear the air compressor going off. The little pancake uh, air compressors are great, but if you're doing kind of a big project like this, they will go off quite a bit. But, so as you kind of can tell, it's just the same, same build. I want to make sure we get this all lined up. Okay, so get this side done as well. So the great thing about these angled racks is they're, you know, like a V formation. Okay. So they're going to shoot off at an angle which kind of gives a really cool, unique effect to it. I'm going to go and get my... Okay. Let's get... I go to a fireworks store or visit one of the stores I pick up one. And I always love to pick up a couple different packages of candles. They're, they're so cheap. I love it. Four, four of them um, you know, for five bucks. And you get uh, six pack for two dollars. Just to pay upon it. You can mix and match the different uh, effects with them. Now what I'm going to do is I'm putting it on the end base so I can connect the fuse channel. Again, I'm keeping the same design as I have the other pieces. So then that way, you know, again, this is all, you know, they're all stained, pre-stained. I've already stained the, the tips. But it's, when you set up your show, okay, it's really designed for simplicity for you. Okay, you know, once... You have these racks, and these racks are, you know, set up and ready to go. Then you just got to put in your fireworks, fuse them together. And with these racks, you know, with the decade fuse channel, I mean, you can put together some of the uh, decade fuse channel. And you can put together some of these things long in advance. So that rainy, you know, that rainy day, and you've got your show planned out, you know, you can sit there while you're watching TV, Fuse up a couple, uh, 
couple racks of these Roman candle racks. And then when it comes to time of the show, you have more time to have that bratwurst, drink that beer, swim in the pool, and enjoy the day yourself. That's what this is all about. Okay. Now again, much like on the six piece angle, if there's any type of bow in the, the end piece, I always have it bowing out. Okay. And again, the bow is, you know, unless it's a really major bow, is, is not going to affect anything. Okay. Let's go and get this. Okay. Now with this, I'm just going to test this to make sure. That's going to be my end cap on my fuse channel. Of course, on the fuse channel, it's going to have aluminum foil tape and some cable wire fasteners. So you can run the actual fuse through the channel. And then you just have one little fuse. If you want them all going out simultaneous, um, you have one fuse going all the way through. And you just can continue it on straight to your next rack. You just have to connect a connection fuse to it. And we'll show you that here in a like a, a setup video later. So I'll kind of give you, get you excited about some different ideas, some different racks. You know, simple things that can just give your show a professional appearance, keep your, you know, your cost down in regards to, you know, what you spend on fireworks. Obviously, keep your sanity in regards to not having 20 people with their hands in the fireworks. And of course, I also give you time back so you can enjoy the day as well. So I got one side done. And of course, on the top, I'm putting in three nails. Okay. So now I'm going to get my, my fuse channel. see the wind and hear the wind in the background as well. It's a beautiful day. So that's, I just want to check. Okay. Looks good. I'm just going to go and test it. Let's kind of get my... And of course, as you can tell, most of the stuff that I've been building, I've already had one pre-built. So I... I you know, make sure my design is going to work the way I want it to look. And of course, I have two sets. So then when I hook it up and utilize a 12 channel firing system, but I have it paired with uh, two different sets, I can be symmetrical in my firing. So if you haven't liked and subscribed to our channel, uh, definitely check that out. Um, of course, you can check out the 12 channel firing system video. So you kind of get an idea what I talk about about symmetrical and building things in sets of two. So that way I have one for each side. Okay. And of course, uh, stain whatever color. Stain just adds additional little warmth to the, the actual product itself. Of course, ultimately, if you wanted to, you can, I'm just going to kind of move them over. You can get kind of creative. You can do just two in the front or four in the front all facing to the left four in the four in the back all facing to the right so you have a set going one way and then all of a sudden it switches and goes the other way or you can have 16 of them going off at the same time or you could you know have a set of eight going off and then another set of eight going off to kind of extend out your show so kind okay, of look out from here so you kind of can see you know you can all go in one direction just a lot different, gives you a lot of different 
tools and resources and to make your show different and unique each and every year. That's ultimately what these racks are for. Okay. So there we have it. Uh, this is an eight piece angle Roman candle rack. So be sure to stop by your local fireworks store and tent, pick up a couple of uh, packages of these Roman candles. So you can add them to your show. And we thank you for watching V3 Pyrotechnic Designs. Uh, if you haven't liked and subscribed to our channel, please do show. Please do so now. And of course, check out some other great videos and uh, share our page with your friends, uh, your firework friends. Give them some great ideas as well. So thank you for watching and be safe.